If you ever play with photo mosaic programs you know that more tile images you have in the mosaic library the better mosaic you will make. In a real life projects like an anniversary gift or a wedding present you frequently don't have all these thousands images. Usually all you may find is just about a hundred of family photos. We will show you how to make a nice black and white mosaic using these resources. The secret of this mosaic is an image tiles preparation. Usually there are many photos with complex subjects, few persons, few objects. If we'll print them as a small tiles the people on these images will be so small that nobody will be able to recognize anything. We need to cut and crop the complex images. This way, we will make tiles with simple and recognizable subject, and in the same time, we will considerably multiply the number of tiles. We will show you how to prepare tile images with Click to Crop Image Editor. Run Click to Crop. For a start we need to set up some useful options. Select from Menu Edit, Preferences. Check Maximize Selection on File Opening option, it will maximally expand cropping frame for every newly opened image. Select Custom Path with Incremented Original File Name option. Also checking Start with Last Open Picture. OK. Select Open Folder from the File menu, or use a Speed button to select a folder with our images. Here we are. Select the first image. Hide Image Browser. We want a library with square, black and white tiles select from menu aspect ratio square to get a square cropping frame. Check gray radio button to convert our images to black and white automatically. First crop is a maximal possible area. Double click over the cropping frame will initiate a saving process. When the program saves in the first time at the working session it shows a save dialog. Select a place where we want to save our tiles. Create a new folder for them. Click to crop will give the names for saved images automatically. Press the save button. First tile saved. Saved area is marked. Enlarge two faces. Double click. Saved. Zoom mother face. Double click. Saved. Zoom to baby face. Double click. Saved. Next button to go to next photo. That's why we selected gray mode. This old color photo is faded. We may improve it with auto level function. Maximum crop. Baby face crop. Mother's face crop. Double face crop. Disable auto level. And go to next photo. Four persons are not fit in our square frame. Three from the right crop. Three from the left crop. Two faces crop. Two faces crop. Two faces. Expand a bit. Crop. Face crop. Face crop. Face crop. Face crop. Next button to go to next photo. Photo is tilted. Drag the top right corner to pivot. Good. Pan the frame. Crop. One more tile. Head photo. Crop. Next button to go to next photo. Three persons on the right. We photo. Apply auto levels. Crop. Three from the left. Crop. Two crop. Two crop. Two crop. One crop. One crop. One crop. Adjust. One crop. Let's see how things are going on. File, browse output folder. Here is it. We have 31 simple tiles made from 5 complex photos. Few more efforts and out 100 photos will turn into 500 tiles. 
In the next tutorial, we will show you how to make a good mosaic with these 500 tiles.